voice actress Christina V. Now I want to ask you. <laughs> it's a little loud out here. Cosplayers are downstairs waiting for the cosplay. But anyways, how did you get discovered? I hear that's a pretty interesting story. Yeah, um, I was a fan. Well, I am a fan of anime. I've been going to Anime Expo for years and years. Um, I auditioned for something called anime, uh, AX Idol at Anime Expo, and uh, that's how I got a, got my foot in the door. Then I started getting more recognition from um, my work on YouTube. I did fan really? dubs, yeah, fan dubs and uh, song dubs, and I just put post them online, and people started noticing my work from there too. So those things together have finally, you know, yeah. led to kind of you know the beginning of a career. I hope. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> Cool, so I heard that you were um, also in a voice acting panel. Yeah, after I was a reject from AX Idol, <laughs> um, I went to this panel the, the following year, and uh, it was a voice acting panel, and uh, Wendy Lee chose me to go up and try the machines out, and um, that's where, you know, they heard my verse for the first time, and they gave me a card right after saying, hey, come audition for us. Cool. So, yeah, so I got to audition for Boo for Shamurai Shampoo. Oh, so that was your first role that you auditioned for? Yeah, that was my first role. My one of three auditions I've had so far. Wow. Yeah. Okay. What are the other two? Um, I auditioned for Haruhi Suzumiya in Haruhi. Um, I actually begged them because it was a secret audition, and I happened to find out about it. So I actually uh, called them up and asked if they could audition for Haruhi. Although that was never submitted for yeah. for different reasons. And also Aika and Aika R16, I had to audition for. Okay. Cool. So. Who was your first big role? How oh. intimidated were you? Was it doing that, you know? Um, actually, I wasn't cast as Foo. Okay. That was uh, Perry Walgren. My first big role oh, okay. was Canaria in okay. Rose and Maiden. It is I, Canaria. It's as good as done, isn't it? And I have to say that I was pretty intimidated. Really? You know, um, you hear, you listen to anime dubs for years and years, and you know these people, and all of a sudden you're acting off of them in a series. Yeah. So it did take me a while to get past that, to get out of my head a little bit. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it, it is a little intimidating. Yeah, you sing too, right? Yeah. And I've seen some of those on YouTube. Oh, yeah. Yes. When did you get into singing? That was kind of by accident. It was uh, somebody asked me to sing for a fandom. I'm like, oh, I can't do this. And uh, yeah, I tried it once and I fell in love with it. And so I just kind of, you know, started doing it more often. And I decided, you know, I'll post it on YouTube. And next thing I know, it has two million views. Wow. For, yeah, for the Hi That's Hi Hi huge. UK. Yeah, it was. And then I got banned. <laughs> so what's your favorite type of music? My favorite type? Uh, hmm. I really love show tunes, Broadway. That's my favorite kind. Or uh, Eurobeat stuff, kind of from DDR. Yeah. Yeah, and of course, anime songs. Uh, that's always fun. What's something interesting that your fans may not know about you? Something interesting? Fun fact. <laughs> a fun fact? OK, I had a hamster. It was my sister's, and I accidentally killed it. Because I, I wanted to play a cliffhanger with it. And it just, yeah, I made it hang from something high, and it died. Oh, that was it? years ago, though. Years ago. <laughs> and, uh, did it suffer, or was it kind of immediate? It suffered. Sadly. <laughs> it had a seizure, and then it survived the night. And the next morning, it was dead. That's so horrible. I carry. <laughs> I carry that with me wherever it, I go. That was a long time ago. He's yes. Just, he's in hamster time. heaven now. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you so much for spending time with us.